Hello and welcome back to Tea with Tracy, coming to you live every Tuesday at 12, spilling relevant tips, trends, and talk in all things real estate and home ownership related. Today, I'm really excited because I am going to be kicking off today my local business spotlight series. So each week now through the end of the year, I will be bringing on a different local business owner to talk about what their business is, what they have to offer, and give you some ideas of where you could do some of your holiday shopping this season. So without further ado, to kick off the season, I have my friend and owner and creator of Sarah's Bath Boutique, Sarah Luxinger. So thank you for joining us to kick off our local business spotlight series. And uh, you are the owner and creator of Sarah's Bath Boutique um, in downtown Lake Orion. Um, but it's not just the, the name is deceiving, right? Cause you do not just have bath products any longer. I know you started off that way, but you've recently expanded. So tell us what, uh, what can, when, what can people expect when they walk into Sarah's bath boutique? Well, actually, because we expanded our products, we also expanded the name. So it's Sarah's bath, uh, kitchen and home boutique now. Awesome. All right. I'm going to make that change. When, <laughs> as I'm telling everybody, go to Sarah's Bath Boutique. <laughs> oh, I, I still, the, it's too big to fit on my like hanging yeah. sign. Yeah. It's still Sarah's Bath Boutique. Yeah. It's confusing, but you know what? We're not a big corporation. We can tell everybody about it and it will be okay. Yeah, absolutely. So, so you have, okay. So I just used one of your bath bombs the other night. Uh, I needed a nice relaxing bath and, um, that was a great way to uh, great way to relax. So that's something um, I know. In the past, like I, I've used and I love your loofah soaps. Um, yeah, those are amazing. I actually was gonna like give props out to them. Yeah, yes, a loofah. Oh, it's so nice, and because even once you use through the soap, you still have a great loofah that you can use. You can continue to use. And I actually use those those pizzas of Rufa either like as gentle, gentle exfoliating like for my face yeah. or as a soap dish when oh, I'm in the shower. Oh, that's a great idea. Yeah, so yeah. all that gunk, you know, from your soap doesn't get on the, the shelf or your soap dish. So, yeah. so and it's gentle so. enough to use on your face. That I didn't know. That's great to know. Well, you gotta be, you got to be very, very gentle and like really, really wet it. Don't like okay. go nuts on your yeah. face. <laughs> yeah. Uh, no, no. Nice and gentle. Okay. All right. So, so you've expanded. So what, what else? So it's not just bath, it's home. Yeah. We got home decor, home products, some low and zero waste products in here. Um, I am pregnant and I just couldn't make everything to fill the store up. And I also think that eco-friendly is the way to go. It's a, that it, that's the trend and it's a good trend and I think it should become more of an everyday thing, not just a trend. Absolutely. Anyway, um, so we got some of those products in here from other small businesses. Um, and then behind me, well, of course now it's opposite, but it's a filling station. So you can bring in your own jars and bottles and fill up on soap, dish soap, all purpose cleaner, Castile soap, which you can use for like a lot of things. I got detergent, I got wax melts, votives, bath salts, and toothpaste tablets right there. Wow. See, toothpaste yeah, tablets. So can, How does that work? How does a toothpaste tablet work? Um, so you throw it in your mouth, you chew up a little bit, and then you brush. Oh. Great, great for traveling. I we was just going to say, stuff. yeah, if you go traveling or like if somebody camps, like I could, I can see that being oh, yeah. like fantastic to use. Oh, so. yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, very nice. Okay, so wait, wait, wait. We kind of skipped over. You're pregnant. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. yeah. So congratulations. Oh, so what, you you decided to, like, you know, create some new employees? Like, the, the business is expanding, so you're going to bring on right. your own team? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Starting to groom him early on. Yeah. <laughs> oh, little one. That's yeah. fantastic. Well, congratulations. And um, that is very exciting. Very exciting. So... So, I, but it, there are hazards with it. Like, yes, the last week, I, I, I don't know how big my belly is. Like, I mean, I do, but, <laughs> you know, I knocked over my label maker and 
that was that. Oh, no. I've got a new one in today, and now i got to figure out how to do it. But, oh. So there are some work hazards with the yeah. knocking them. <laughs> Yeah, your your personal space is expanding, and so you have to get used to those new dimensions, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> uh, not, too, um, not too used to them. I, after nine months, I, I don't want to have them anymore. Right. So. <laughs> right. Oh. So. So you. Yes. So, the, oh, go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. No, I was going to say. So you're you are getting ready because we're we're heading into whether we're ready for it or not. Winter is coming. So, and uh, those of you who are Game of Thrones uh, fans, like, <laughs> you'll appreciate the reference, but winter is actually coming. And so to prepare for that, you're, um, you, you tend to, one of the things that I love is that you, your products, although the basis of them are, you know, generally the same, you do put a lot of fun seasonal spins to them. So they make great gifts. They make, you know, great like pieces or show, you know, to put, if you're like soaps and things, if you're going to put out. So um what's what's new for this uh this winter season so funny you should ask i just so happen to have some bags of goodies so um last year these were a huge hit so i'm bringing them back and they are my little oh that's adorable hand painted yeah um, decorated and yeah, so you get three bath bombs. I got peppermint right now. So they're they're a great gift, especially for people who love baths. Yeah. And going by, and um, I don't charge extra for customization or you know orders. Um, you can pick out what scent you want and your snowman bath bomb. Oh, that's awesome! I love that. So you know, a lot of my uh, friends and family watch this program. So just close your eyes because. <laughs> Or pretend to be surprised if you see that maybe down the road. <laughs> right, right. And we also have, um, so I do gift wrap for a buck or I already have it all done. But it, you get a box, you get everything. So. Yeah, you do a beautiful job. I, you know, I, you custom made some gifts for my daughters last year. And, oh my gosh, even the packaging was beautiful. So. Well, here's some examples of packaging. Um, we got bath bombs and we got um, shower melts sets. Uh, pretty cute. And, you know, shower melts are always great, especially if you don't know if somebody takes a bath or not. Um, I actually usually sell out of my shower melts before my bath bombs. But the ones that are really, really popular in the wintertime are the eucalyptus and peppermint ones because those really, you know, aromatherapy. Mm -hmm. oh, I also yeah. got Ease the Day, which is spearmint and eucalyptus, which is really really nice and because they're so popular i got the value packs they usually come oh. in two packs but now i got the four packs and like a lot of things buy bulk get it cheaper yes absolutely oh well i think most people are bulk shoppers out there right that yeah. we're all so busy so you go and stack up on some things so yeah that's and that's why the filling station is really great too you can come in um and i was just saying you can bring your own bottles and jars I got bottles and jars here, Okay. Um, but you just fill up. Let me weigh your bottle first, then you fill up, and then we weigh it again. And it's if you bring your own bottles in or save the bottles and reuse mm -hmm. them, very comparable to, um, you know, grocery store and drugstore prices. Okay. So, and so, it's so well, friendly. Exactly. Yeah, eco-friendly, and you get to come and actually, you know, see and pick in different seasons and... Um, yeah. I think that's awesome. So, yeah. yeah. And if you want to reuse, um, reuse your packaging too, that's a great option because even though many of us use our recycling bins, um, you know, sometimes things don't actually make it into the recycling pile, like, you know, so it's nice to know that you can actually reuse, um, some of that packaging. So, yeah. Yep. So, um, and speaking of it, uh, winter coming uh, a lot of people come in here and they have really dry skin um, so I got the lotion bar it's uh, it was actually what prompted the whole store I was making it um, and I gave what I gave some to my neighbor and she's like you got you got you got to start charging people for this <laughs> so neighbor that's uh that's how Sarah's back to cheek started actually Sarah's back to cheek started 
when I clogged this kitchen sink twice in a month and had to have <laughs> and my husband's like, you really got to do this somewhere else. <laughs> That's the real story of Sarah's bath. And but we'll just say it's the lotion bar. But I got those in um, unscented. All, they're all natural. Um, I got unscented. I've got lavender and I got tea tree. So really okay. good stuff. Moisturizing. That's like I do in the winter, mm -hmm. um, you just slather it on and put some cotton gloves on and go to bed. That's awesome. Yes. So you can get that uh, that moisture throughout the whole evening. Wake up all ready to go the next day. I know because I think a lot of us, especially in the winter, we wash our hands so much. Um, in the summer, we don't notice it so much. But in the winter, we're, we're in the dry heat and then washing our hands. Like they can get like the fingertips, your fingertips can get chapped. So. Oh, yeah. And if you're dealing with a lot of paper, I didn't realize that when I started law school, all of a sudden my hands were like, like getting brittle on it. I was like, what is going yeah. to <laughs> paper? Yeah. Um, I actually have cuticle and face oil as well that saved me during the beginning of the pandemic when the, the hand sanitizer was that terrible stuff yes. uh, that was like, like burned your hand, burned your skin off. <laughs> yeah. I, it looked like I had like an elephant trunk right here because I was washing my hands so much. Um, and I would put like a couple of drops, it comes in a dropper, the cuticle oil um, and face oil. I'd rub it like just, you know, probably like three or four drops per hand. And then I would put on lotion afterwards and it, it really helped. Because I thought I was going to yeah. scar. It was so bad. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Well, so... Even for your worst um, chapped fingers, your lotion, it sounds like uh, it works some minor miracles. So, <laughs> Well, you know, I'm a crack and bleeder. I'm a crack and bleeder. It's very mm. embarrassing when you have to, like, shake somebody's hand in the middle of the winter and you're like, oh, sorry, I didn't mean to get some, like, flakes of skin on you. <laughs> it so, so to save from embarrassing moments to, uh, to make your, your, your skin feel more comfortable, you might want to check out the, uh, the lotion bar. <laughs> are you in business and, and, hands? Yes. yeah <laughs> i got a product you need yeah <laughs> oh well is there anything else that you that you have that you want to share i know you have lots of different gift sets and um yeah we'll be bringing back the gift sets and again what's good about local and uh having the artisan in store yes um you can customize and usually bath bomb shower melts turnaround time is 24 hours okay they gotta they gotta harden sure. so um, as much as i try i can't speed up that time yeah <laughs> but uh so turnaround time is pretty quick um so don't i don't hesitate if you want to come in i've had people come in not knowing what to get and we just talk through you know do you know what scent they like do you know what color they like do you if they don't know those things, then you go through, well, what do they smell like? Do they wear perfume, <laughs> et cetera, et cetera. If you go to their house, what kind of silk, like, right. do they have? Right. Yeah. So we, we can figure it out. I'm, I'm like a amateur detective. <laughs> Becoming more and more professional as each uh, year goes by, right? <laughs> yeah. Well, that's awesome. So if you want a custom personalized gift um or even if you just want to check out and see what's you know on the shelf and in stock stop in and see sarah downtown lake orion um you can also get a uh a, get a feel for her growing personal space and um and see how that progress is coming along as well <laughs> yeah yeah hey so it's just keep on getting bigger yeah it's fun. Yeah. Those of us, those of us who have been through it, we, we understand, we feel, we feel you. So, um, well, thank you so much for, for taking the time and joining us today. Um, you know, you'll be seeing me, uh, in the shop and, and around town. So, um, so thank you so much for joining us. Thank you all for tuning in and, um, we'll see you next Tuesday at 12 on Tea with Tracy. Thanks. Bye-bye.